Prophetess Yinka, a former senior member of the Synagogue Church of All Nations, Squan, has narrated her encounter with some indigent children whom she said appeared before her in Malawi. Today, I had a wonderful encounter in the presence of God in the beautiful city of Malawi, a warm heart of Africa, she wrote in a social media post on Tuesday, December 28. Whilst having quiet time with God, I closed my eyes and I saw these wonderful children beside me, asking for my help. I don't know them. I said to myself, this is God speaking to me. After telling me their needs, the Spirit of God asked me to attend to them immediately. Brethren, anywhere can be a best place to witness for Christ. Brethren, if you consider how far you have come, you may not want to share the dividend of your success with others. I thank God for giving me this assignment I never prepared for. Glory be to God. After giving the kids money and other items, she wrote in another post that, Blessed be the name of the Lord. Let's continue to be our brother's keeper. No one can succeed alone. Prophetess Yinka and fellow ex Kwan member, Prophetess Anne, on Christmas Day, held a special charity event for the physically challenged at Glorious Light International Church, Lilongwe, the capital of Malawi. The event was broadcast live across Prophetess Yinka's social media pages. A series of pictures of the event posted on Facebook and Instagram came with the message which quoted Jesus as saying, Whatever you do to the least of brethren, the needy, physically challenged, that you do unto me. Yinka and Anne also thanked Bishop Abraham Simama of the Glorious Light International Church and his wife for hosting the special Christmas event. Reflecting on the words of their late mentor, T.B. Joshua, the women said, We need good people, informed people, and inspired people to make it in our respective callings. Thank you.